Hey everyone, today is Saturday, January 22nd, 2011, and I'm here to do my seven month lock update. Uh, what I've noticed so far about my hair is that the towards the bottom of my locks, um, they are getting a little bushy, um, a little frizzy and poofy. Um, I've noticed that in other people's um, lock updates too, like when they do like their seven, eight, their nine month um, pictures and stuff, I see that their hair kind of gets a little poofy as well so I'm not really worried about that I figured that's something that happens uh, also I colored my hair um, a few days before New Year's Eve I went ahead and colored my hair like I told you guys I was going to I did it uh, what is this blue black um, it's Revlon, Revlon color silk number 12 uh, natural blue black is what it says and it was two dollars and ninety four cents at Walmart so I got it. <laughs> it was a, the cheapest one and this one is actually um, ammonia free so um, that's definitely um, one reason why I got it as well because the last time I colored my hair when I was loose um, I didn't know any better and I got one that was that had ammonia in it and my hair was so dry for a few months so um, I learned my lesson with that and I went ahead and got the ammonia free. Um, it took me about maybe 15-20 minutes to apply the whole thing to my hair and it actually um, I didn't use the whole bottle. It was like probably about, I used maybe a half to about three-fourths of the bottle, so I did have some left. Um, of course, I threw it away because you're supposed to. Um, so, yeah, it, I did it. It washed out, and when I washed it out, my hair wasn't super-duper dry. Um, it was... It was a little on the dry side, but not like, and not anything like I experienced with my lock with the last time I um, colored my hair. So um, that was good. I was excited about that, but I still am gonna do um, deep conditioning treatment just to kind of help that out a little bit. Uh, also, um, some of you guys are wondering um, when I plan on interlocking my hair again. Uh, the last time I interlocked my hair was a few days before my cruise and that was like November 1st, November 2nd last year um, and I have not done, I have not interlocked my hair since then. Um, I don't plan on interlocking it until about mid-February because I have an interview to go on for an internship so um, I probably won't do it until a few days before them. As of now I feel like I don't need to be on a schedule for interlocking my hair and not doing it every four to six weeks. I feel like I can wait maybe two, three, four months if I need to, you know. Um, I don't feel like I need to do it so often. I want, I kind of want my hair to grow and like kind of just let it do its own thing um, without me keep um, interlocking it. So for now that's what I'm doing. Um, yeah, until, so I'm not going to interlock my hair again until about February. There is some new growth. Um, I feel it's really like curly and wavy in there. I would say maybe about a little bit over half an inch, if not more. Um, so after February, once I interlock my hair in February, I probably won't do it until maybe late April, um, early May, because that's when my um, internship starts. So I'll probably not do it until then. Also, um, I'm using the same products. Everything is pretty much the same. I did go ahead and pick up this um, herbal oil, Africa's Best Ultimate Herbal Oil. I got this from uh, Walmart for a dollar and ninety-four cents. And I'm sure you guys have seen this around. I've seen a lot of people on YouTube um, get this. It has like soybean oil, jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, safflower oil, olive oil, carrot seed oil, all that good stuff in there. Um, and I figured, you know, let me try it, see if it's any different from the the, um, the oils that I use. So I just wanted to try it out. I only used it once, so I can't give you a full review on that. But um, uh, it's okay, I guess, so far. It has kind of a smell. I wouldn't say it smells bad or it smells great. It just has kind of a distinct smell to it. So, um, yeah. <laughs> um, what else? Uh, the weather. It has been cold um, and as far as that affecting my hair, my hair hasn't been drying out because of the cold weather. I would say more so my scalp has been has been a little bit more dry um, because of the weather. Like I've noticed it drying up. My hair starts to itch a little bit a lot more sooner um, when it's time for me to wash my hair. So I'll wash my hair like Saturday or Sunday and my hair starts to itch maybe like Wednesday, Thursday. So 
yeah, I think maybe I think that has something to do with the weather also. You know, as usual, <laughs> I'm not drinking as much water as I should be, but like I said in my last video, I'm working on it. So, <laughs> um, I think that is pretty much it. That all that covers all of my um, everything to do with my locks for seven months. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to ask. Um, also, I wanted to thank everyone who subscribed. I've, no I've noticed a few people have subscribed as of late, and I really wanted to thank you guys for subscribing. I know my videos are on the longer side, and I'm really trying to work on that because I don't like watching uh, long videos, and I know you guys probably don't like watching that either, so I'm tr really, really trying to work on that. Um, as far as new videos coming out, I did go ahead and get my computer. I got a MacBook Pro about a week ago. Um, I've never really used a Mac before, so it's it's taking some time to get used to. And I like glance in iMovie for a little bit, and it looks so complicated. So I'm probably gonna have to go on YouTube and watch a few videos to see how to work and edit videos in iMovie. On so until I get that done, um, then I'll be able to. Uh, do more videos and edit them and stuff like that. So I did go ahead and get a new computer I'm just trying to figure out how to use the editing software on it. So uh, please give me some time on that um, Other than that if you guys have any questions like I said uh, Just go ahead and put some comments below or inbox me all that good stuff And I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care